Hey guys, it's Lindsay from Love Book Triangle Lindsay, and I thought I would give you another bookshelf tour of one of my other bookshelves, so let's get started. So here is another one of my bookshelves. First up top here I got a mishmash of different things. This was actually my first pop ever. I had won a contest and I got a Game of Thrones package and I didn't know really what Game of Thrones was at the time but now I'm so glad that I have it because I love Game of Thrones. And I know this fungal is really pink but I didn't think it was going to turn out as pink as it was. I was going to try to custom it into somebody but I had to redo the skin tone because it's almost a weird oompa loompa feeling going on there for me. This will my Twilight fans will appreciate because it is Boo Boo Stewart's signature. So Twilight Descendant fans, I can't believe I have this. I actually had a picture with him too but at the time I really didn't know who he was and I didn't think anything of it so I never printed the picture and when my computer crashed I couldn't save it. So it's actually him and his two sisters. I met him at Six Flags Great America during one of their concert series. He was opening act for someone and it was said that they were going to be signing some autographs and I had some time to kill in between the show so I got in his line and I got an autograph, got to meet him. He was I think 12 at the time and I was in college but so that was very, very long ago, but now it's so cool to look back on it and think, oh, that's Seth or Jay, and that I actually got to meet him. And up here, it's just some other little random things I got going on, but now to get to the actual books, the first shelf is comprised of all Cassandra's Claire, Cassandra Clare's Shadowhunters series, and it's the top shelf because it's one of my favorites, so I had to get the top billing. And here... I made different little canvases to represent some of the books. I also have that here as well. I know I'm missing some obviously, but we're in a canvas and I just never went back to finish it out. This little rose I actually got from a student and I like the look of it when it dried out so I wanted to put that on my bookshelf. This lanyard is actually from BookCon so I thought it would be nicely displayed on the edge there and for those of you who have read the Shadowhunter books and some of the characters in there you will understand why I have ducks on this shelf and I actually won this one at work so I thought what better place to put it than this shelf and for those of you who watch my other bookshelf tour videos you will have noticed my Walking Dead pops on one of my other shelves but I just ran out of room so I had to kind of pop them in some other places. This picture, I'm sorry about the glare there, was from I believe a book subscription box and it, I just love it because it's of one of my favorite trios ever. This here is a stack of cards, that's just the first one that came from a pre-order incentive for I want to say Lord of Shadows. And then this candle back there, a gem candle, and here I have my pirate pops because I love me some pirate pops. I gotta get some of the new ones. But, so that's that shelf. This is uh, my Daryl lanyard and it has my book con pass on there so I thought it would be fun to put that there too. Here is my Throne of Glass series, the Court series. I got some Saba back here. I believe um, Victoria Avard. Where is it? There is Red Queen and that stuff is back there as well. Of course, more pops. I have Daryl kind of hiding back here. He was displayed better, but then just started running out of room again. And this picture was also from a book subscription box going with the Red Queen series. And I have some mini Funkos that I had doubles of and I tried making some custom figures. I know it's nothing out there like some of the work that people could do which is amazing but I'll have you guys in the comments try to guess who they represent they're from the throne of glass series so that's the back I have some stuff out of clay I want to glue on and have shooting out of her hands but never got back to that and that's supposed to be some shackles and that right there but just in the comments let me know if you think you know who they are 
some candles that came from some subscription boxes and just a whole bunch of other things on that shelf. Down here we have a whole bunch more pops. A little sun catch. I know it's not Halloween, but just leave it up there on the shelf because that's where it stays. And have Lee's books, some Brackens, and all these other series. Haven't read too much on the shelf yet, but I have to get to it. Hockey locker room plate. Haven't read too much on this shelf either. So one day we'll get to that. Just been so busy with some polycon reading, as you guys know I have been doing. And at the bottom is just my mishmash of <laughs> books that I didn't really think had any special place, so I put them down here. I like this granite book because my parents got it for me when they were in Alaska and they got to meet the author and talk to her. Or not, I'm sorry, not the author. I think it was the author's daughter and got signed. And down here, my figures always end up toppling over because my cat likes to try to climb on the shelf. This is a cool little Shadow Hunters bag that I got at BookCon. I like to just keep it folded up because it says the Shadow Hunters there and you can easily see it that way. And then on the side of my bookshelf, I have some more posters that once again I got at BookCon. So I thought it was a good spot to display them. I don't know if you guys can see way in the back there. There's a poster from James Dash and one of his books that we got signed at BookCon. We didn't actually get to meet him, but it was already signed and we got to pick it up. So that was pretty cool. And over here, I know it's not on my bookshelf. And it gets a little hard to see, but I have some Harry Potter canvases that I made. Take it out from the Deathly Hallows book pages and I really like those. I might have to find a better spot so they can be displayed better. But that is another one of my bookshelves and I hope you guys enjoyed looking at everything. Bye!